Rand Water has released uh, weevils and hoppers to prevent uh, the growth of water lettuce in the Val River. Environmentalists say these small insects uh, will help curb the spread of this aquatic plant, which has the potential to poison water. News Africa's Zola Sholana reports. The Val community has been scrambling to halt the spread of water lettuce. Residents say this species was first identified several years ago and has been spreading in the Val River due to nutrients such as sewage and phosphate in the water. We reported the sewer of Infulini sewer works that was malfunctioning was way back in 2009. Since that we've had many promises from officials and Infulini to rectify that hasn't happened. Finally we're sitting with a crisis as a result of the sewer concentration in the river of water lettuce and hyacinth, community has tried in vain, removing it over a thousand ton a day. Rand Water released a batch of wivels in the Val River as part of an initiative to prevent the growth of this plant that threatens the river. This is our first step in responding to the water hyacinth where we released the water, um, the wivels which it eats into the water lettuce. So today we had a ceremonial launch because we intend to release across the, the area that is affected. Environmental experts argue that RAN water did not follow the necessary procedures for compliance. We applied to the Department of Water and Sanitation and they gave us a general authorization under Section 23, which then authorized Section 21, which authorizes us to work. But that authorization has got uh, certain com compliance rules that we need to follow. There's a control plan, there's a risk, risk matrix that we gave them and they approved how we're going to do the job. So that authorization is our compliance document. The Premier of Gauteng conducted an oversight visit of the affected areas and assured stakeholders that the province will get to the bottom of the problem. We're shown an area, we were told that uh, 10 days ago, uh, it was just a small portion. Today we went there, it's almost two meters. Uh, so you can see this thing is moving at a faster pace. So we need to intervene at, at that pace as well, as quickly as possible, arrest it, manage it. As part of their lifetime commitment to the environment, Makubela has assured those affected that his team will monitor the biocontrol mechanism. We have a monitoring app that we started using two weeks ago that uh, on a weekly basis it gives you the status, you can see the growth and therefore you will start seeing on the app, you will start seeing the reduction. But over and above that we are deploying an individual as Renota on the site on a weekly basis to be here daily. So I would say to answer your question directly, on a weekly basis we will be monitoring and, and just checking if our efforts are yielding the results that we need. Rand Water says it's confident that the weevils released by environmentalists in the Val River will halt the spread of water lettuce. For Newsroom Africa on Channel 405, I am Zola Shalwana at Val River.